All right, guys, I'm gonna keep it rolling. Give it up for Mr. Damon Rogier, everybody. Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Oh, come on, I don't risk my life to come on this stage tonight. But that's the love I get in here tonight. Come on now. That's right, I don't risk my life. I came all the way from Brooklyn, New York to be with y'all tonight. Yeah, that's right. The only reason I say that, cause I need to ride back. That's what I'm talking about right there. Are you kidding me? This is 2014, I found out a lot about my situation. I'm an alcoholic, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Oh, come on, some of y'all are just like me. I'm gonna find out what's real. If you like to get drunk, let me hear you say, hell yeah. There's more of us in here, there's more of us. Some of y'all don't know who y'all are up in here tonight. You ever got so drunk that you had to ask God to help you through the night? You ever got that drunk right there? And I don't care who you are, when we get that drunk, we all say the same thing. Lord Jesus, if you help me through the night, I swear to God I'll never drink again. I swear to God, I'll never drink again. Ladies and gentlemen, there's signs to let you know that you're a true alcoholic. I had to stop drinking. That's right. <laughs> One night I was at the club. I got so drunk, I stood up. <laughs> I was messed up. I was all right up until the moment the guy next to me told me I was standing up. He looked me dead in my face. Uh, uh, you know you stand enough? I said, let me sit down before I lose my benefits. <laughs> I know somebody watching me here tonight. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I can't make this up. I cannot make this up. One night I was at the club. I had three shots of tequila, two apple martinis, and a Corona. I was messed up. I got in my car, drove home, and left my wheelchair outside the club. How the hell am I gonna get out the car now? <laughs> Y'all laughing, I was in the car for four days. <laughs> People always ask me, Damon, why you make that face when you're on stage? I make that face because that's what you walk and people think I'm supposed to look like. Y'all laughing. I use that to my advantage. Like, I like to go in a store and steal stuff. Like the other day, I was in CVS, and I was stealing deodorant. Security seen me, he was like, hey! He said, go ahead and take it, go ahead and take it. <laughs> Y'all laughing. These are true stories right here. And I'll tell you the truth, 2014, ladies and gentlemen, I'm a single father, I got two kids, yes indeed. Come on, show me some love, two kids. That's right. I found out my kids are magicians. Yeah, <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> my kids magically make the money out of my pocket disappear every week. Like I try to be the cool dad. Everybody wants to be the cool dad and I found out that my kids was robbing me. The other night my kids like, Daddy, you got a show? I was like, no, I'm here. He was like, uh, won't you come to the movies with us tonight? I'm like, okay, okay. He was like, we're going to bring a couple of girls with us. I'm like, hey, whatever. So I get up to the uh, movie theater line, go up to the box office. None of the kids move. I go in the pocket. They want IMAX 3D. Ladies and gentlemen, let me explain to you what IMAX 3D is. IMAX 3D is a mortgage on your house. That's what it is. <laughs> These movies are too expensive. My son said, you know, daddy, go on and uh, go on take care of that. We get you later. Come to find out, they get me later with the allowance that I gave them. That's my money. 
this is ridiculous. And I love my kids, I just don't like them. Don't get it mistaken. Come on, all the parents in here, you know what I'm talking about. You can love your kids, you ain't got to like them. Yeah, because I came back from a different time. I'm 47 years old, ladies and gentlemen, just turned 47. Yeah, stop playing. Yeah. Come back from a different time where you used to beat your kids. You remember that right there? I came from a different time. My mother was abusive to me. I got beat with everything in the house. Let me put that out there real quick. I got beat with the extension cord. Anybody got beat with that? With the TV still on it? With the TV still on it? I got beat with the Hot Wheel track. The Hot Wheel track. That's my toy. How do you beat a child with his toy? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one night I came home, my mother beat me with my brother. I said, this got to stop. <laughs> what is wrong with you? But all the parents know, now the government is all in our business saying you can't beat your kids in the 2014. I just want to know where was the government at when I was getting my ass whipped like a runaway slave. <laughs> Nowadays, these kids got 911 on speed dial. You see this? Everybody got it? Yeah, man. Uh, go ahead and hit me. You'd be a ghost in the morning. <laughs> we couldn't call 911 back in the day, ain't that right? You know why? Because we had the rotary phone. Y'all remember that evil too? You know how long it took for that nine to come back around? Your mother be, go ahead and touch the one. You'd be dead, dead, dead. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's my time. I thank y'all, I thank y'all, I thank y'all.